Hi gang, welcome to my channel. For those of you who just happen to be stumbling across my video, my name is Valentina, and today is not quite my viewpoint, it's just a little explanation as to where I've been. So I don't know if you know or not, but I actually moved into a new house. Uh, thankfully, we were able to close finally, lucky number 13, and we were able to move in. And in this house, I have what will now be my home office. And I also have a closet, which will be strictly my bag closet. So I'd like to show you what I've been doing. This is my closet. And inside, if I can do it without being too awkward, I have started organizing it's a little haphazard at the moment but organizing all my lug bags so this is one half um there's a vera backpack that's where i'm going to keep spare planners and things like that that i have um again here's all my bags i'm just getting the collection in then i'll probably switch up these hangers with something different in this drawer i have just little pouches and stuff that didn't really fit um, there's a heart pouch, just little pouches and things. And then I just have the rundown of bags that I just want to kind of keep. Um, you know, I have a co couple coach bags, some bagalinis, mostly lug though, a Vera, you know, and then down here, same thing. Uh, that's a purse organizer. I'm just going to keep little miscellaneous things there. And then when we get to the other side, of course, more more bags, more lug bags, predominantly. Um, and then what I've decided to put over here, this is my container with all my little reusable totes. Uh, this little container just has my tripod and my example phone and a dust bag. In this one, I have more pouches and wristlets and things like that. Um, I took a page out of it was a Xena Warthog Princess's book. I, I noticed she had bins for like certain pouches and things that she would sometimes take things out of. And I thought that was a fantastic idea. So thank you, Xena. I appreciate it. Um, I did steal that idea a little bit. Now, eventually, of course, I will be getting, there's a bagalini uh, in here. There's just different uh, but I will be getting matching bins and stuff. But right now I'm just working with what I have down here. Some more uh, coach. Another look, a few lugs, of course, my Coupe XL, a Vera, that sort of thing, Bagalini. And then also down here, wallets um, and pouches that are just a little bit bigger. So yeah, so that's, that's my closet. It's still definitely a work in progress because I still have so, so many more bags to unpack. <laughs> Also, as a little sidebar, um, I'm going to be putting either contact paper or painting the shelves in there, getting that wiring out of the way. We're just trying to actually figure out what that wiring's for before we take it out. And it is, you know, something important that we need. Um, and uh, I don't think I'll put a rug or anything on the floor, but yeah. Uh, so just to let you know, I am very aware that the shelves look a little grungy, but they have been thoroughly cleaned and sanitized. Um, they just don't look the greatest. Uh, this house was built in 1958 and it was literally owned by one couple, which such a fantastic story, but owned by one couple um, that did really do a lot of modernization modernization which uh my husband and i don't mind we love it we love the you know the look of the whole house um but there is a few things that we're going to just you know upgrade slightly but not really change the overall aesthetic of the house um and perhaps one day i'll even do a house tour who knows uh anything's possible on my channel because it's my channel <laughs> all right guys thanks but yeah um oh sorry that's just way too close um but yeah so that's it for the moment uh i was supposed to quick story time before i go i was supposed to actually get my vegan leather cable car um in blush pink but it turns out uh the ups facility lost it before they actually could get it sent to my post office wow my, I'm just a total mess because I've just been moving boxes and furniture. Anyway, but yes, they lost it. Uh, so I had to put in a claim with UPS. And then I also contacted QVC where I purchased the bag. And QVC is phenomenal. They're going to be sending me out a replacement. But I had been holding off, waiting to get that bag in order to do a video. But since I couldn't do that because now the bag, hopefully, fingers crossed, will be getting to me on the 11th. Um, I have no new bag right now to do a video with. I did find some old lugs of mine, like literally I found the very, very first lug that I ever got. So I might do a video of that in the future, not sure. 
But, um, but yeah, so that's it for today's video. Um, I apologize again for being a little MIA. Um, hopefully, you know, you guys uh, are having a great day and I will talk to you all as soon as I can. All right. Thanks guys. Bye.